Hello, and welcome to ShipU Stats. In this video, we're going to go over a statistic that's new to JASP as of version 15. That statistic is the coefficient of variation. The coefficient of variation is going to tell us our relative dispersion, which is compared to the standard deviation, which gives us our absolute dispersion. To calculate our coefficient of variation, we're going to go ahead and click on Descriptive Statistics. And from here, we can go ahead and move over the variables that we're interested in getting a coefficient of variation for. Before we actually calculate that statistic, let's go over here and look at our descriptive statistics for these two variables. You'll notice that both of these variables have standard deviations, which are relatively different from each other, and they also have means that are relatively different from each other. These standard deviations are telling us the standard deviation or dispersion around these means. And so comparing these two standard deviations when these two means are far apart is not necessarily appropriate. This is where the coefficient of variation comes in. If we go ahead and click on statistics and go down here to dispersion and click on coefficient of variation, you'll see two values pop up here. You'll notice that these two values are relatively close to each other. They are different, but this is a much better way of comparing the dispersion here because we don't have to worry about these means being so far apart and the relative variation around those means. Here we can see that relatively the variation of these two variables is quite similar. The coefficient of variation is calculated by taking the standard deviation and dividing it by the mean. All right, thanks for watching this short video on the coefficient of variation in JASP.